This, my good people, is what we get from a good night's hustle. These guys. For Deluxe Magazine, I'm Tony Scott, and this is iTony Tech. It's tech news for non-geeks. Nothing complicated, just simple tech news you need. Extreme gadget obesity is a condition that people have, people that store unused electronic gadgets for at least two years. Four in 10 Americans are holding on to their gadgets. Why? Most likely, it's not a priority, but it could be you haven't got around to taking off those pictures and videos. You know the ones. Websites like Gazelle, Nextworth, and Ucell will buy your gadgets. Ucell accepts around 500 different phone models, working or damaged. Ucell says the average user can sell their devices in less than two minutes. Not just phones either. Old iPads, iPods, tablets, video games, and game consoles. You can also recycle them, but you won't get any money out of that. The hardest thing to sell is a camera. Smartphones have better cameras than a lot of the old regular cameras do. How'd you like to buy a mouse with a computer built in? Mouse Box's plan is to pack a regular looking mouse with a flash storage hard drive like the one in your smartphone, Wi-Fi, and three USB ports. The mouse connects to a monitor and a wireless charging pad doubles as a mouse pad. Now there's no demo yet or a price or a timetable for release, but it sounds pretty cool. Microsoft Office is a real money maker for Microsoft and they're about ready to drop their latest version for Windows 10, Windows 8, and 7, and OS 10. Now the Windows version will work better with a keyboard and a mouse and not a touch screen like they've been using lately on a lot of their stuff. It'll most likely be subscription based. That'll keep the money coming in. Look for a bundle package too. Xbox Live, Xbox Music, Office 365, and Skype Unlimited World and Wi-Fi. If you want to watch the Super Bowl on your desktop, iPad, or iPod, you can. Download the NBC Sports Live Extra app for the iPad or iPod Touch. You'll need no cable or satellite subscription and you'll get 11 hours of programming including the game, the commercials, the halftime show with Katy Perry and Lenny Kravitz, and even an episode of The Blacklist. Now if you have Verizon, you'll get the game on the NFL mobile app. If you don't have Verizon, you're only going to get replays and commercials. And if you live overseas, Sorry, Charlie, you'll have to pay $9.99. Now, there's an app called Super Bowl Stadium that will give you replays from four different angles, plus the commercials. As of this recording, though, it's not in the App Store. Dillian Thompson and Dorian Walker Gaines are stupid. They allegedly stole an iPad, a laptop, $5,000, and some other stuff. They took selfies that were uploaded to the cloud, and they even put a video on Facebook. This, my good people, is what we get from a good night's hustle. Watch what he said. This, my good people, is what we get from a good night's hustle. We doing a big face being over here. New, old. We just hustle. Don't don't worry about no how. No 20s, no 20s, no 5s, no 10s. I, read it. Big, big face. face. Big. If you hustle, you worry about what you and yours, you get this. Yes. That's all you got to do. Yes. You know, stupidity is truly an art, and these two are magnificent. That's all I got. Please click the thumbs up button at the end here, and subscribing to my channel is appreciated. Thanks for watching iTony Tech. It's tech news for non-geeks. For Deluxe Magazine, I'm Tony Scott.